now it's my big pleasure to welcome Mr. Lee, Mr. Lee Herrer. He is the Vice CEO of Kayuan, which is a company based in Munich in Germany. But it's of course a Chinese owned company. So they have been working a lot in providing educational and other special interest uh, tour programs for Europe. Uh, and this is of course a growing market segment and is very interesting especially for SMEs and for destinations which are not on the trodden paths in Europe. So Mr. Lee, thanks a lot for joining us from Munich uh, here at the World Bridge Tourism Project webinar in preparation of the EU China Tourism Year 2018. So your company Kayuan or K-Trip as it's uh, called in uh, the Western version is one of the biggest Chinese tour operators in Germany and in fact in Europe and your mother company uh, U-Tour is one of the biggest tour operators in China. So operating out of, out of Munich all over Europe uh, you have developed a special field of, of uh, groups coming for education, culture, business, and other special, special interests. So I think we would be very happy if you could share with us, based on the long experience you have, some insights into this latest developments in Chinese Outbound Tourism in Europe, especially in this field of special interest groups. KTRIP is a company focused on overseas destination online travel services. And uh, we are one of the largest Chinese travel agencies in Europe. Since its foundation in 2005 in Munich, Kittrick has been deep rooted in Europe and established further office in China, France, Great Britain, and many other countries. Kittrick is a community to provide customers the most professional, high quality, and all inclusive services. Now, we have many products covering a variety of forms, including bus tour, individual tour, special group on individual request, as well as official reception. For each travel behavior, we can offer the right product. Okay, thanks a lot. Uh, very interesting. So can you tell us from your company's experience some examples a bit more uh, talking about this so-called niche markets or special interest fields and of course we all know that in China even a niche uh, comprises a lot of people. Uh, so what uh, good offers, what opportunities are there for, for Europe? So and also of course when we talk about the Chinese travelers on this special interest tours would be interesting to know more about well, the age uh, where they live in China and uh, how to reach the special interest groups. We can definitely identify some special interest fields. Vacation, healthcare, and education trip are the most popular nowadays. Education and healthcare is very important to Chinese people, especially to the upper and the middle class customer. They would come to Europe to learn a language or to get some training on a business area or medical treatments such as uh, ISI surgery or cosmetic surgery. We are very focused on education package. Our main target group for that are student and the business manager. We are serving a wide range of group of customers aged from 18 to 80. So another example will be tours that are designed for families or older customers to spend their holidays visiting their family member living abroad. These people could not join other groups because those are usually too fast and uh, too exhausting. So we design packages that are slower and more suited for their needs. Uh, yes, health and education. These are the big topics in many markets and certainly also in the Chinese market. So uh, a question a lot of people are discussing in Europe is that more and more Chinese outbound travelers do not join package tour groups anymore, but they book the trips by themselves. 
traveler as a FIT or what is called a free and easy traveler. So do you think that offering special interest oriented products, sports, culture, art, food, photography, training, so you mentioned uh, health as well, very important, can that help in cooperation with companies like yours for European tourism service providers that they still get the share of the growing spending power of the Chinese visitors to Europe? Yes, and uh, we are already doing that. We started to promote a sport package with a special focus on football and marathon. As an example, uh, we are collaborating with the Munich Marathon in order to support smaller company and the local traditional actives. In winter time, we offer skiing holiday and the weekend passes in the Alpes. Chinese middle class customer care more and more about their personal feelings and they will spend more money for this on euro experience. We already have a long term relationship with our service part, uh, providers uh, in the Europe and uh, we are keen to develop further uh, collaboration with the tourism office and uh, providers all over the Europe. We have very good media access and uh, we could also help them to promote uh, destination or activities to Chinese customer. We believe the cooperation will bring benefit for all of us. Okay, uh, Mr. Lee, uh, I know you're, you're a busy man, so thank you for taking the time uh, to, to talk to us. And so uh, we, we see sometimes uh, to find a good distribution partner for the Chinese market, you don't even have to go to China. Uh, you can find them also here in Europe. So thanks again, and uh, I'm sure uh, there will be some people uh, watching our webinar today who uh, will be interested to get in touch with you.